I had a person ask me the other day how I knew the Bible was God's word. They wanted to know, you know, how is the Bible the authority and, you know, how how are all the other religions different from you when you all pretty much say the same thing about faith and about each other? And so how do you know who's true and who's false? And that's a lot of questions. But ultimately, they all have the same answer. It's not really a sign of showing proof. There's an abundance of proof. For the Christian faith and the pages of God's word, but no one can make you believe it. It's something that you have to decide for yourself. Even the religious Pharisees of Jesus's day, they had Jesus in the flesh speaking to them face to face, and yet they couldn't get past their doubt and unbelief. There were miracles. There were signs. There were prophets in the Old Testament who prophesied of Jesus, and their prophecies were fulfilled. But as plain as day in front of their faces, they chose instead to reject that truth and to be loyal to their flesh. They just could not fathom the idea of a simple gospel. But Jesus tells us who he is. In John 14, 6, he says, I'm the way, the truth, and the life. No man comes to the Father except by me. It's not my job to convince you of the truth. My job is to simply share the truth. The choice to believe is up to you. You're free to receive or reject. That's your right. But before you make your decision, I just want to challenge you to read the book of John, even if just chapter one. Read it and tell me what you think.